What's up, my people? This is Showbiz the Dope. It's Friday! Boy, 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 boy. All right, man, look. Keith Thurman. Keith Thurman. Still. Still. You're still running scared for Meryl Spence. You're st Hold up. Coffee. Even at night, I'm drinking my coffee. Yeah, man, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm wearing a blazer because I just came back from my daughter's uh, high school graduation. Congratulations to you, show, uh, busy baby. Congratulations to you. Oh, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I broke in the sixes, man. I broke in the sixes. Ain't beautiful. I love, I love the red, man, and not the pink. You guys got to pick you up a pair. Last time I'm wearing these this year, I'm sure of it. All right, so Keith Thurman. Run a scare from Errol Spence. Look at here. Still, look, when I started my YouTube channel, um, I started it because Keith Thurman was making me sick to my stomach how he's running scare from Errol Spence. That's how this whole showbiz the adult started, okay? So I had a show business partner. Shout out to you, D. Ross. He sent me um, an interview with Manny Pacquiao, Keith Thurman on Speak For Yourself. Okay, Jason Whitlock over there grilling Keith Thurman. Look at that and look at the last minute, okay, with uh, 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 Jason Whitlock grilling Keith Thurman, asking him about Errol Spence. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Let, me get, let me get this right. Let me get this right. So Jason Whit Whitlock is like, hey, what's up with Errol Spence? Keith Thurman's like, hold on. Let me get this right. Let me get this together. Keith Thurman's over here like, uh, you know, you know, uh, uh, hold on, hold on, let's get to this. You know, uh, uh, what's the Errol Spence? I don't know, what, 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 what's the Errol Spence? And Jason went like, it's like, are you going to fight Errol Spence soon? And Keith Thurman. Get Keith Thurman together. Let's keep Thurman. Uh, 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 wait, uh, well, well, uh, 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 one fish, two fish, uh, uh, red fish, blue fish, knick knack, patty whack, give a dog a bone. Jason Whitlock is like, look, man, we waited for Manny Pacquiao versus Floyd Mayweather. Do we have to wait for you and Errol Spence? That would be fireworks. Keith Thurman's like, well, you know, he's the second uh, best welterweight in the world. I'm the first best welterweight in the world. And we're, and we're trying to get the ball rolling. You know, we're just trying to get the ball rolling. Uh, 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 and, and, and we, we will fight. Uh, we just want to get everything started. Hey, look, man, are you going to fight Errol Spence or not? This dude finally said 2020. Let me tell you something, man. This dude was dancing around the question like nobody's business. This is how I feel about it. I'm sorry. If Keith Thurman, if you're watching, I'm sorry. But I got to go in on you, dog. Let me cross my legs. Mama, I'm rocking. Look here. Keith Thurman, you can beat Errol Spence. You're better than you think you are, man. You're talking about, Keith Thurman is talking about getting the ball rolling. We got to get the ball rolling. That was the biggest thing that came out of his mouth that showed when he lifted, uh, when Jason Whitlock lifted his skirt, there was no balls under there, man. When he said, we're trying to get the ball rolling, you don't get the ball rolling against Manny Pacquiao. You're, that's a challenge in front of you. We know you're taking the challenge fighting Manny Pacquiao. That's not getting the ball rolling. You're using the old excuse. You're using the excuse you were using against Lopez. That's no excuse now because we know you're ready for war, but you're only ready for war against guys you think you can beat, man. Now, we know you can't fight Errol Spence next. We know that. We know it's not in the cards. But when you hear Terrence Crawford talk about Errol Spence, he know he can't fight Errol Spence yet, but he's screaming out Errol Spence because that's what fighters do. We know the truth. Terrence Crawford and Errol Spence has a hard fight to make, but that doesn't stop Errol, uh, Terrence Crawford from drooling at the mouth for the opportunity just to fight Errol Spence. They're sitting there meeting, bumping it into each other in the hallways, yelling at each other. Errol Spence is doing the same thing with Terrence Crawford. You got these pit bulls barking and growling at each other, and you over there with a belt undefeated, you beat Sean Porter and you beat Danny Garcia, about to fight Manny Pacquiao, and you're stuttering about Errol Spence, man. Keith Thurman is as good. He's good enough to beat every. I'm going to bat for. I'm saying, man, Keith Thurman, you could, you're going to beat Manny Pacquiao in a controversial decision because to keep it real, you're no, you're no Manny Pacquiao. Keith Thurman is no Manny Pacquiao, but he's younger. He's younger, so he's stronger. 
So you can get that under your belt, be, become a, a legend in the making. Stop sounding like a coward. See, if you don't believe in yourself, you, that's the person you have to convince is yourself. You don't believe in yourself, you definitely going to lose against Errol Spence. You got Sean Porter fighting you, fighting Kell Brook, fighting Danny Garcia, and now fighting Errol Spence. You got little Mikey Garcia going 12 rounds with Errol Spence, and you're stuttering. I can understand when Errol Spence was an, en an enigma or some kind of, we don't know what Errol Spence is on. I can understand that back then. But you just saw Mikey Garcia go 12 rounds with Errol Spence. And you over there still stuttering. Man, look, don't have me flip on you, man. Don't have me start saying, hey, Manny Pacquiao's going to knock you out. Because I'm already rooting for the man at 40 years old. I don't know what... Keith... Hold on, hold on. Let me get this. Let me get this together. Keith Dan's time thumbing. I'm out.